Hello friends, welcome to 30 days series on the Spring Boot. Today is day one. What is Spring Boot? Spring Boot is an approach to develop spring based applications with minimal or less configurations. By using Spring Boot, we can achieve rapid application development. That means quickly we can build and run production grade applications by using Spring Boot. And this Spring Boot is not replacement for the Spring Framework. Spring Boot internally uses Spring Framework only. And what are the advantages with the Spring Boot? First advantage, POM Starter. Next, Auto Configuration. Next, Actuators. And next one, Embedded Servers. POM Starters nothing but the dependencies that we are configuring for our application like Web Starter, JPA Starter, Security Starter, Actuator, etc. Coming to Auto Configuration. Based on the starters we have added for our application, Boot will identify the configuration and it will provide the configuration for our application. We no need to write any XML configurations here. For example, if you add Web Starter, it will provide a Tomcat server to run our application. If you add JPA Starter, it will create a connection pool required for our application. If you add Security Starter, by default it will provide HTTP basic authentication for our application. Okay, then embedded container as we already discussed Spring Boot will provide the servers to run our web application. You no need to set up any Tomcat server to run your applications which are developed by using Spring Boot. So you can use Tomcat, Jetty, Netty as embedded containers for Spring Boot application. And coming to actuators. Actuators are used to monitor and manage our applications. So actuators will provide production ready features for our application. We can do health check. We can check thread dump, heap dump, etc. by using actuators. Thank you for watching this video. Please comment on this video which topic that I need to discuss in the day 2. Thank you.